Hey, it's Richard Olsmuller, and I am at Surrey Valley Point of View Vineyard, and uh, the proprietor, uh, Jeff, uh, just gave me this uh, t-shirt. I was just hanging out with him. And I got to show you um, what I'm looking at over here. And uh, so, yeah, here we go. Here's his uh, vineyard, his wine, this, yes, the, <laughs> the vines. <laughs> growing that's a real rooster that you're hearing over there uh so um yeah this place is pretty freaking cool i love uh vineyards like that where um like you can as you should like you know go on the property and enjoy the place and so any place any case uh yeah it's just pretty cool uh came at the right time and um Ah oh, man, I love it. It's like just being in nature. Uh, it's so great. And man, I gotta show you this with like actual grapes on the vine over here. It's so beautiful. Um, man, this is great. So, in any case, right, this is wine country, North Dakota wine country. Um, you know, I write about in my student loan book where I've been into, um, you know, wine country in. Um, <laughs> Portugal, and I've been to California, and uh, I've traveled around so much, but I haven't seen. And that's that's his thing that he uses to scare the birds, which is so they don't eat all those grapes. And that's I love it. It sounds so exotic. It's, it's pretty cool. So, any case, like I said, I've been I've been all over the world. I write about my student loan book, and uh, if you haven't bought it, you should buy it. And uh, you know, but I've never explored uh, North Dakota over here because I was uh, a little bit too pretentious. I'm like, oh no, North Dakota, there's nothing there. And but it's, I'm completely wrong. So I'm doing a little road trip and uh, exploring it. And uh, so yeah, this is one of the places. My little wine tour, the North Dakota wine tour. Uh, yeah, Jeff uh, was telling me that uh, there's uh, 17 uh, places over here in North Dakota that are making wine. And so I've only been to, well, this is the first one I've actually been to. There's another place where I went to where uh, I tried to get into the winery, but they were closed for the season. And um, so I didn't actually get to see the winery, but uh, I went to a bar where they were selling the, uh, um, the wines over there, and I bought a few of those wines. And I gotta like get you. So, walk backwards over here so you can see my view it looks this she's got an amazing view over here and so anyway um this is only stop two of me i've got like a few other places that i'm going to go to and yeah you got to see this this is just like looks really good like over here where i live in wofford city north dakota there is very little trees but this is kind of nice that there's there's trees here and a uh, spectacular view Love it, love it, love it. And so I hope to come back. Oh man, he's he's got this place set up right. It is uh, definitely a place that you want to come to and uh, and just chill, relax, enjoy the day, enjoy life. And uh, yeah, had a very good time. Enjoyed uh, speaking with Jeff. I'm glad that we had the opportunity too. It wasn't very busy. So um, yeah, in any case, recommend it. Come on out to... Uh, Come on out to North Dakota wine country. And, uh, right, yeah, don't do it at uh, the stereotypical wine countries. I mean, all right, do those two. Portugal, that's, that's a fantastic experience. California, great experience. But uh, do something, you know, a little um, not mainstream. That's what I'm saying. And, uh, yeah, come out. Come to North Dakota. Come to North Dakota. You'd be surprised. And uh, so uh, I'm surprised. I did not expect to enjoy it as much as I am, and um, it's, uh, man, I've been in North Dakota seven years, I can't believe it's taken me this long to, uh, you know, to get to this point, but whatever, you know, here we are, and I'm enjoying it, I'm having a good time, and uh, you will too. All right, thanks for watching, I love you, I appreciate your support, and uh, yeah, buy more of my books and give them uh, to your friends and uh, give them to your enemies too. Uh, that don't read uh, to teach them a lesson. I don't know. Whatever. All right. Thanks. Bye.